Hi everyone, how are you? I'm going to I'm going to take one of Rebecca's ideas from Dances with Bulls for the hashtag 100 Things Challenge, um, where she just used some of the catalogues that you get sent in the mail, and she just covered them with um, pattern paper. Um, I think Shannon Green also has also done that. They, um, made them into like journals for no reason. So that's what I thought I'm going to do today. And I have this container here. And I have been adding to it just like all little scrap bits, um, cutoffs from my other projects. And my plan is to get rid of everything in this little folder. That's the plan. Didn't say it was going to happen, but that's my plan. <laughs> so that's what I'm going to do now. And I'll just put this into fast forward. This is the book I'm going to use. This is um, one of the books that we get over at our bowling club. And it's Tweed Life. It's got um, one. It's got fourteen. It's fifteen pages, um, single pages in it. So that's what I thought I am going to do. I am going to cover this and make it into a journal for no reason. So I hope you enjoy the process. And I've lost my glue already. Oh, it's going to be one of them days. <laughs> I'll be right back. I actually had to have a little stop and go out and wash my hands because <laughs> the glue on them was just driving me batty. Oh, glue on my hands. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to start again and see how far I get before I have to stop once more. 
to wash the glue off. So that's it. That's my gluing book finished. I've just got to let it dry. I am going to put some tape down the side here though. As soon as I find it. Where is it? It's just here. Somewhere here. There it is. I found it. I'm just going to put a bit of this tape down the side here just to make it a little bit more sturdy and to hold it together better. I can't see what I'm cutting. Okay, and I think I just ripped that apart too. I did, look. That's okay. I'm going to glue, I'll glue it back together. Tape it back together. Alright. So, yep, the staples came out of that. No problems. I got some more tape. And 
Maybe she'll just push that down there. I was just a little bit too rough with it. Okay, so there's the cover. This is just a journal for no reason made from one of my pamphlets that I got in the mail. And there's, I put that little pocket on there. That'll stick there fine. There's that one. And this was, oh, it was just so freeing because I didn't actually think about what coloured papers were going on the page. I just kind of like done it. And I ended up putting that disc there, which is um, a card. Just trim these edges off here because that will bug me. And I'm going to, I will put another bit of that tape just in the back here as well. Just so that I know it's going to hold together. Oh. This is like a, um, a masking tape, not a, a washi tape. And I'll push that down in there. Just so that I know it's going to hold that front page on. And we'll cut that bit off there. Do I need to cut that? Yep, I do too. There, all trimmed up. Now I've got to go and wash this glue off my hands again. i done pretty good, only having to stop once to get the glue off my hands. And there's the back page. So... That was pretty good. I might have to actually put some more tape down here, but I'll just leave it and let it let it go and see how I went and see how it goes, I mean. And look at this. I have still got Oops, wrong way. I've still got heaps of these scrap papers left. I've got, I've still got this one to do. I'll do this one off camera. So that might make up a, take away a few more of these. But oh my goodness. I think I'm after suggestions what to do with these. <laughs> oh, me running out of ideas. Oh dear. What's the world coming to? See, look, it's still, it's still quite full. And... Quite a few papers went on to covering this little book, booklet. Oh, that's up already. I think on some of them I should have used a stronger glue because some of the papers are a little bit thick. But there you go. There's my um, number... Oh, what was it? Number... I'm glad I'm keeping a record. My memory is just shocking lately. So this is number nine. And... I don't know really what to call, call it. Okay, we'll just say... Um, journal... Made from pamphlet 
Oh, P A M P H. Um, gluing down. Now I don't even know if I've spelled gluing right. Gluing down <laughs> scrap papers. Okay. Um, yeah. So that's number nine. Yay! How cool is that? Alright, thanks everyone for watching. I hope you enjoyed. And if you've got any ideas for me on what little projects I can do for this 100 thing challenge and if I've got the if I've got the the items here to do it, I'll have a go. So if you want to um, just give me a little inspirational boost, an ideas boost, just leave a comment down below for me and I'll see what I can come up with. Okay, you all have a great day and I'll catch you later. I'm going to call this one here a second uh, a separate one from this one. <laughs> <laughs> okay, have a great day. Bye-bye.